Hey guys, my name is Puspender Sani. Once again, I came with the part two of Realm Library. In this tutorial, I'm going to tell you three things. One is how you can migrate the database in Realm Library, how you can update the database, and how you can delete database for the particular value for the particular field. Okay. So in last video, I have tell you how you can save the data and how you can read that data which you have saved. Okay, but in this tutorial, I'm going to tell you how you can update, how you can delete particular data from uh, the Realm library. Okay, so let's begin with development without wasting any more time. So guys, I'm here. First uh, task is how we can migrate two database into the Realm library. Means suppose, let me tell you the example why we require migration. This is my field. Okay. Now here, I would like to add one more parameter gender okay from here if i will run same code then it will throw the error to you i'll show you in real time here you can see the migration is required due to the following error so that's why migration is required if you are in development then you can easily install your application and start your working but if it is in production then it, you, can you cannot uninstall your application and again install so in favor of user we required migration okay so let's do the migration i'm keeping this field as it is from my app delegate i will import first realm library after that here let config and it is realm dot configuration the first parameter is schema version and it will be your current version the second parameter is migration block and here the first one is migration the second one is old we can say old schema okay and we will write in if old schema is greater than or sorry less than one then we will keep as it is okay it will be as it is now after that we will assign this schema this will be like that and from here realm dot configuration dot default configuration equals config okay if i will run this version then you will find error free code okay so that is called migration now the second task is update data from realm library here. hey guys so write some code for uh, update so here here it is let realm first of all we have to take the object of realm and th this will be with try catch okay so here it is realm with capital realm yes now we have to find the object so let main model equals realm dot here will be object and type of object it will be main model class dot self now filter on the basis of age so here age equals and it will be 25 okay so after that it will return us last object now we can check if main model is not equals nil then we will proceed with write so here it is try uh, realm dot write block and inside write block we will operate let now i i want to update this title okay uh, we can say some title at the place of this I will update hey this is my title okay so let uh, we can say some object equals uh, main model dot some object fine and if it is nil then some object we will take define now the second thing some object dot title 
इक्वल्स हे दिस इज पुष्पेंद्र थाइटन ओके सो दिस विल बी द अपडेटेड वैल्यू आफ्टर दैट वॉट यू हैव टू डू मेन मॉडल यू हैव टू सेट बैक द वैल्यू टू द मेन वन ओके वॉट एवर यू आर डूइंग अपडेट then at the final stage you have to set that value over here so main model dot sum object equals sum object fine now you have done with this task now after a data updation we have to print the data so my data will be over here we also require one queue so dispatch dot main dot uh async code and over here i am going to print my updated data so how i can print that so guys here i have done the small changes i just replay this and i keep this code out of the main asynchronous this queue. time i'm going to delete some data okay so how it will be the delete operation same thing dispatch q dot label and here we can give some label okay fine now let realm equals try same so fine now after that i'll find the object okay so let model equals real dot object from ah uh, yes it's type of main model class dot self dot filter and where we can say age equals twenty five. fine now this object i would like to delete i need to take some unique number okay so i can say let where counter equals 0 and it will be type of int and over here one so in id in first id not here here i am going to take counter plus 1 and it will be here counter equals counter plus 1 by default it will be 0 so here i am going to pass counter fine now after that i will fetch the last value where we can say where id is what is the id is counter so now let or we can say try real dot write and it will be block and here real dot delete object which object we would like to delete it is model okay so and here we can say dispatch same like that copy and lb after delete we can say data is deleted now i am going to run this one object two object and here it is read here you can see three object now i am going to delete where id is last one okay id is 2 so delete delete has been done now again i will read and now you can see one data has been decrease okay so like that our delete functionality will work if you have any doubt related to the complete video complete tutorial then please comment into the comment box and also do not forget to subscribe my youtube channel because on my youtube channel you will find lots of video related to swift development like how you can overlay view controller how you can design tab bar 
how you can swipe how you can implement swipe gesture in your application how you can create country picker how you can design your custom card view many more tutorials you will find on my youtube channel so thank you so much for watching the complete tutorial have a great time bye bye